trapped and alone, a man relies on an old computer and his entertainment skills for survival, only to discover he's not alone. A barely dressed man wakes up in an almost empty room. Confused, he tries to ask for help begging to be released. When ignored, he turns to an old computer nearby. Trying to input commands, he is told they are invalid. Then, the system asks, share? He responds, yes, initiating a sharing process. Thinking the computer is prompting him to talk about himself, the captive faces the screen, wondering if he's being tested. He wishes for his immediate release because he has a dog to take care of. Nonetheless, he receives no response. After using the restroom, he realizes the sink has no water. Suddenly, the computer makes a dinging sound catching his attention. Once more, the screen displays the share. The captive runs the command sink this time, but nothing happens. Trying water, the system responds with water 5. Perplexed, the man replies with buy water, but the computer answers insufficient. While the sharing process continues, he lies on the floor momentarily, releasing an unpleasant gas. Suddenly, the computer dings five times, urging him to investigate. At the top of the screen, he notices the number 5, and beneath share, the option buy appears. Feeling thirsty, the man attempts to purchase water. The system asks if he wants to buy water for five. After responding with yes, water is added to his inventory. Quickly, he goes to the sink to drink from the now operating faucet. Gradually, he grasps the system. The number on the screen's corner represents his points, used for purchases or simply as currency. During sharing sessions or live streams, he assumes someone's watching, prompting him to engage in random acts like talking, releasing unpleasant gas, or slipping during headstands, all earning him points. After this, he attempts to buy good food, only to receive kibbles leaving him disappointed. He vents his frustration to the monitor, pleading for release or an explanation but gets no response. Hungry and desperate, he resorts to barking like a dog and eating the kibbles, increasing his points to 34. Observing this, he spends 20 points to buy good clothing, only to receive a brassiere. He jokingly wears it, which the computer dings once more. That night, the confused man sits on the floor, head on his knees shedding tears. After his emotional breakdown, he brightens the room and initiates sharing. After getting points for doing stunts, he purchases a t-shirt and an inflatable mattress. He keeps doing the same thing until he can afford better items. He orders the best food in one of his streams but gets beef. His points increase when he complains about it because he's a vegetarian. Later, after drinking the hard beverage he bought, he gets intoxicated and tries to make funny commands on the system, but they're considered invalid. He loses points when he attempts to smash the screen with the empty bottle. As he throws up, the power abruptly shuts down, rendering everything unusable. Despite his attempts to seek help, there's no response. Desperate, he tries to escape by removing the computer monitor or using the dumbwaiter, but to no avail. Hours pass and the man becomes increasingly upset, repeatedly pleading for release. He resorts to throwing everything in the room in frustration, yet his efforts yield no results. Facing the screen, he begs for forgiveness, recognizing his ingratitude for what he had. He pleads for a chance to prove himself as a good person. Person. The power suddenly returns and the computer turns on, displaying that there's been an upgrade. Much to the man's surprise, an older guy appears on the bottom corner of his screen, congratulating him for surviving the turnaround. The stranger explains the system, mentioning socialization as a perk. He reveals that he's also trapped like the man and they're working for unknown captors. Later, the older guy keeps talking during his live stream. Annoyed, the other man assumes he's a chatterbox and tries to type in mute and silence, but both are invalid keywords. Desperate, he asks the talkative person to pause his stories for a while because he's still trying to comprehend what's happening to them. That night, the man wakes up and approaches the computer. This time, he notices a new option under share labeled receive. When he selects it, the system prompts him to respond with a number. He enters 42, and another person appears on his screen. It becomes clear that he can watch other people from his room. On the screen, he observes a streamer doing a cooking show. Despite his attempts to get the man's attention, he goes unheard. Undeterred, he enters another number and sees an old woman singing on the side of his screen. He continues to input different numbers until he discovers a yoga instructor. Suddenly, a reward prompt appears on the screen. He responds with yes and gives the woman two points. Hearing this, the older guy on the other side of the screen reacts, recalling a woman he watched before who went through her day without pants. Annoyed, the man types stop receiving, and the yoga instructor's screen disappears. Frustrated, he returns to his bed. During his live stream the next day, the older man discusses near-death experiences, earning only two points. Suddenly, he sees the other guy attempting a backflip but getting hurt. Hearing the stuntman's points increase due to the comedic act, he comes up with an idea to befriend him. 
that evening, the older man apologizes to the entertainer. Later, he showcases a magic trick, asking him to pick a card and keep it in mind. Moments later, he reveals a Five of Diamonds card, which astonishes the man as it matches his selection. Impressed, the man asks to learn the trick, but the older man requests him to buy him food first, which he obliges. Soon, they develop a rapport. Curious, the stuntman asks what had happened if something tragic occurred to them and whether the system knows it. The older guy explains that they're reduced to their identification numbers. He's number 6395873, and the stuntman is number 14. He suggests that those responsible for their situation don't care about them. Number 14 then asks what the mysterious people want from them. However, number 6395873 explains that they're now running the system, and captors do live streams for survival. The older captive then reveals that he used to be married before ending up trapped in the room, and his former wife became a famous singer. When he sings his ex-spouse's popular hit, the stuntman recognizes it and confesses having the biggest crush on the celebrity. That evening, number 14 watches the yoga instructor's stream. He attempts to send her a message, but his command is invalid. Because of this, he simply rewards her with 14, hoping she'll notice that it's his identification number. The following day, number 6395873 proposes a collaboration with a stuntman. He praises his amusing actions, like farting and falling over for which people reward him. The older guy advises the entertainer to make himself more irresistible to generate excitement for his audience. Number 14 follows the advice, and number 6395873 begins coaching him on content ideas. The entertainer then tries cooking and incorporating gagging after singing, which earns him more points. Soon, the rich stuntman shares some of his earnings with the old man, who also taught him a card trick that became a hit with his audience. With his points, he also starts purchasing good furniture for his room. After watching the yoga instructor's stream, number 14 rewards her with 14 points that night. The wellness guru notices this and wonders what it could mean. Suddenly, the famous stuntman hears number 6395873 cuffing, prompting him to purchase medicine. A list of options appears, and he chooses chest, intending to buy it for 250 points. After running the command, another screen appears, and number 14 sees a woman, number 52605011, taking a shower. He tries to communicate with her, but the lady freaks out. She accuses him of putting her in the room, prompting him to explain that he's just like her. Soon, the woman also encounters number 6395873 when a screen appears on hers. Later, she asks them if they've attempted to escape. However, the old man implies that they've put themselves in the room. While the old man is away, the woman questions the entertainer further, asking if he's been punished. He confirms this, explaining that some of his points were deducted when he tried to smash the computer. This information leads the woman to speculate that a security system must be in place to prevent them from accessing something significant. Number 52605011 observes that it's suspicious they're trapped in a comfortable environment rather than something torturous. She wonders about the reasons behind their selection for this confinement. Number 14 reflects that perhaps he was considered a nobody before, but now he's recognized and earning from it. As a result, the woman realizes how the system works and begins using her talents for survival. She puts up a live puppet show, which surprisingly increases her points. Impressed, the old man praises her work and reveals that he is coaching the stuntman with his content. Number 14 watches the yoga instructor's live stream again that night. Afterward, he notices number 5260501's poor living conditions and decides to help by rewarding her with 100 points. The woman is surprised by the gesture, but the popular entertainer explains he wants her to buy curtains for her bathroom. However, she takes offense, stating that he doesn't need to do things for her. The following day, number 14 starts a drawing lesson for his audience, sketching himself in minimal clothing. Once again, his comedic act earns him a significant amount of points. Later that day, number 5260501 still fixated on escaping, suggests using number 14's popular platform to influence and convince people to get out. Threatened with losing what he currently has, the old man opposes turning the entertainer into a messiah. This disagreement escalates into an argument with number 14, where the old man reminds him that he coached him so he can improve his living conditions. Suddenly, number 6395873 cuffs, and the famous stuntman angrily wishes for his eventual demise. The woman intervenes to defuse the tension between them. That night, night, the old man's cough persists. He wakes up and tries to do push-ups, but the cuffing doesn't stop. Eventually, he finds his face pressed against the screen, prompting his worried friends to wake up and check on him. When number 6395873 says he can't move, number 14 swiftly utilizes his platform to request assistance. He does a failed cartwheel, garnering numerous points. Meanwhile, number 52605011 attempts various commands to help the sick man. 
After his stream, number 14 also attempts to input commands to seek help. Suddenly, the woman alerts him to a new command she's discovered. She tries inputting the old man's number after the refresh prompt, but it only causes the man's location to burn. In panic, the famous entertainer urges her to turn it off, but she struggles. Unfortunately, the room continues to burn, eventually resulting in the demise of number 6395873. This tragic sight devastates both of them. The next day, number 14 does a live stream but remains speechless about what happened. Nevertheless, he continues to accumulate points solely because of his presence. Later, he attempts to comfort number 52605011, emphasizing their good intentions. He explains that what happened was beyond their control and reassures her that it wasn't her fault. However, despite his efforts, the woman remains devastated and refuses to get out of bed. To lift her spirits, number 14 performs a sock puppet show for her. It proves effective as the woman eventually gets out of bed and invites him to drink and dance. As they dance, the famous entertainer asks her about the last thing she remembers from her old life. The woman recalls trying to learn a song on guitar so she could sing it to her friend's baby. While playing the record, she noticed the singer's face on the cover, but her face appeared as a dark hole cut out in the center of her vision. From there, the darkness grew, and the next thing she knew, she was inside the room. In return, number 14 remembers watching his brother's dogs. One of the animals needed to relieve itself, but he petted it instead of letting it go outside. However, the dog ended up urinating anyway. Later, he stood in the doorway, looking down at the dog who was looking back up at him. Suddenly, he experienced a sensation like a hole punched right through him, and then he woke up trapped in the room. Caught up in the moment, they resume dancing, and the woman playfully exposes her behind. This sight excites number 14 who requests her to repeat the action. In turn, the woman encourages him to do the same, eventually leading them both to engage in self-pleasure. Later, the famous man confesses that he feels his former coach's presence lingering. He recalls their conversations and how much he disliked his tendency to talk incessantly. However, he tries to convince himself that what he misses is merely the virtual version of the old man. Number 52605011 interjects, explaining that their late friend and his pain were real. In response, Number 14 reminds her that they tried to help the man, and if only his audience knew what happened, they'd be angry. He then proposes his plan to get everyone connected, to influence them to find flaws in the system that'll eventually lead everyone to work together. The woman smiles and agrees to be a part of his plan. Following this, Number 14 starts another live stream. He instructs the audience to refrain from giving him points and instead urges them to simply listen to his message. He convinces his viewers to escape to the real world by advocating for everyone to work together to uncover the flaws in the system. He concludes by emphasizing that collective action is their only path to freedom. During number 14's live stream, the yoga instructor, number 3849128, appears on the side of his screen. She commends the stuntman's speech and draws parallels between his philosophy and her approach to bringing her supporters into her glow circle. Number 52605011, who also sees the wellness guru, is intrigued to learn more about her perspective. The yoga instructor shares her belief that they're akin to windows that people are drawn to. She observes that viewers are more inclined to engage with windows that radiate positive positive energy, hinting that number 52605011 has a negative aura. Following this, she excuses herself so she can rest. Afterward, number 14 and the woman begin exploring other live streams. They soon realize that the speech had a significant impact, as everyone discusses collaborating to dismantle the system. One streamer reports that she's discovered a glitch. She puts on a blanket, only to suddenly start raining indoors. Later that night, number 3849128 awakens, and number 14 converts with her. She compliments him, stating that his content brings happiness to people, and confesses that she's also a fan of his. However, she expresses concern about him potentially injuring himself during his stunts. In response, the popular guy admits that he has hurt himself a few times, but appreciates how she has helped him through difficult times with what she does. Hearing this, the wellness guru invites him to join her in a breathing exercise. Soon, number 52605011 rises and approaches her computer, interrupting the breathing session of her virtual neighbors. She then brightens her room and goes for a shower. Later, number 14 and the woman get to work. She discovers more glitches through other people's live streams, noting that some can control their ventilation systems and walls. Upon deducing that there might be different rooms with different bugs and glitches, number 52605011 suggests building a map of how they're all connected to find a way out. However, number 14 appears to have a change of heart, expressing that perhaps some people are content living within the system. He explains that while while he's still upset about what happened to their friend, he acknowledges that they can't continue to incite anger in others. In response, the woman trims her hair, 
there, stating that she is removing distractions which she considers more powerful than suppression. That night, number 14 comes across someone new in the system, prompting him to remember his first day. Number 38491828 starts her live stream later that night, awakening number 52605011. The rebellious woman complains that the noise interrupts her sleep. In response, the wellness guru stops her exercise and engages in an argument with the rebel, accusing her of being a bully and controlling number 14 like a puppet. She points out that the woman's actions attempt to sabotage what everyone has built. Hearing the commotion, number 14 intervenes, causing the yoga instructor to retreat. The famous entertainer then expresses his concerns about their plan with number 52605011. He worries that if it doesn't succeed, people will turn their backs on him, resulting in him losing everything he's worked for. The woman explains that those who remain will be the ones who love him the most, which resonates with him and brings clarity. The following day, number 14 instructs his audience to give him one point each for a head count. Seconds later, his points jump to 103 million, indicating strong support for his plan. Suddenly, the yoga instructor accuses the stuntman of stealing from everyone. Realizing that it appears like that, he promises to return the points. But the woman clarifies that it's impossible because he doesn't know all the identification numbers of his supporters. Number 52605011 intervenes, accusing number 3849182 of undermining their efforts and suspecting her of being an agent of their captors. She urges viewers to silence the yoga instructor for intervening, and someone complies, suddenly causing it to rain in her room. In panic, number 14 urges the person who silenced his friend to stop. However, the agitated wellness guru incites her followers to make number 52605011 pay for what she's done. Immediately after, the rebellious woman's room starts burning, prompting her to retaliate by typing the command and subjecting the yoga instructor to the same ordeal. From his room, number 14 is in shock while watching the two women burn, leading to a sudden power shutdown. Later as he cries, the door behind him surprisingly opens, making him realize that his plan worked. As he prepares to leave, the computer suddenly turns back on and asks if he's willing to share. Excited, he goes live and shows his followers the real world behind him, expressing happiness that they've finally made it. However, the door suddenly closes, shocking him. Realizing he's still in the middle of his live stream, he quickly performs a tada gesture, earning him more points. Strangely, a black hole emerges from his face as he stands still and fills the screen. Subscribe to watch more videos like this. Turn on notifications and leave a like to help the channel out. Thank you for watching.